I'm Andrea Primer, and today we are checking out LGI. Now this is a newer builder that's come to our area, but they are nationwide. So I just recently sold my first LGI home and truthfully, I was really super impressed with their whole process. Um, it's very <sighs> streamlined, I guess. Uh, they have a very set way of doing things. They do not deviate at all, including the home tours. Um, but it was very thorough, and I guess that's why they don't deviate. They are very, very, very thorough with their process. So it was interesting. Um, but the way that they're doing business is really, really interesting, and it's allowing a lot of people to become home buyers uh, without the must and fuss and nonsense. So I really did like that actually. And the houses are very, very nice. Um, especially for the price. You guys won't believe the prices on these houses and you know, they have upgrades in them and I mean, they're beautiful, but come take a look and I'll show you what I mean. Okay. So very open. Look how pretty this kitchen is. This is literally my favorite style of kitchen where it's bright white, granite countertops, everything just really lots of counter space and cabinets, but it's open. So like you can do dishes in this very deep <laughs> sink. Um, I think for me, I would have maybe put the dishwasher on the other side. I know that makes like very little sense to you, but if you're gonna put the dishes away, they're probably gonna be over there anyway. So, but I can see why they did this. So it's, yeah, otherwise they would have had to go further out and then that's gonna cut into your walkway area. So I get it, I get it. So pretty, so pretty, very bright. Okay, so I guess we're starting from the left. Normally I go to the right first, but uh, we're gonna go to the left today because I'm feeling different. <laughs> so pretty good size, I guess it's about eh, 10 by 10. Carpet in the bedrooms. And then again, and the closet isn't, isn't too bad, not too huge, not too small. Just, you know, kind of standard closet. Um, and then we have last one. And this one I think is just a little bit smaller. I could be wrong, but I think this is more like nine by nine. I don't know, it just seems a little bit smaller. So, okay. And I don't know what's in here. Door number, whatever. <laughs> so these are the LGI homes. And I really wasn't sure because I had never seen an LGI home. And I wanted to really, you know, know what it was, what the process was, whatever. By the way, they're just really nice houses. I mean, look at that. I would screen that in. I got a guy if you decide to do that. Okay, so I'm guessing this is the pantry. I really hope this is a pantry. It is. It is pretty decent size. Not walk-in, but pretty decent size. But I mean, all of those cabinets, yeah, it's a lot of cabinets. Um, okay, let's go ahead and go into the master, which has a pretty decent size walk-in closet here. I fit in it. Pretty sure all my shoes would fit. <laughs> this is actually about the size of the walk-in closet I have, but my husband has his own walk-in closet. So there's that. You could probably get a California King in here. Why the one window? Anyway, okay, then we're gonna go over here and you've got double sink. Huge mirror, uh, and then you've got separate bathtub to closet, and then you've got this right here. Now, for me, I would probably be doing like a wood overlay. Have you guys seen that where you put like really thin wood? It looks like they're wooden shelves, but it's actually just something that goes over top. <laughs> it's kind of a cheat, <laughs> but I would do it. Okay. 
Okay, and then we have the laundry room. I mean, for a four bedroom, two bathroom, it's a pretty good size house. And then you have the garage, which is two car garage. And it has a water heater here. And a little bit of extra space over here, storage. So you could do like a workbench or if you have a truck especially, that extra space over there is really good for getting a big old truck in. That would be helpful. And then the air conditioning is up here, but it doesn't look like That's like a massive drip pan. That's, wow, okay. <laughs> They're like absolutely determined nothing's gonna fall on the garage floor. Okay. We go over here. And back into the kitchen or the, <laughs> the living room. So this is more like a formal living room or if you wanted to do like an office or something like that. And then that would be like the family room over here. So interesting, all the re recess lighting. It's a lot of recess lighting actually. Very pretty. And then this is laminate. Very interesting. Not sure about their choice of colors on this house. This one is sold though, so I can't say anything because somebody obviously liked it very much. This, I just wanted you to kind of see what a finished house looked like, so I begged entrance. I was like, Ranch, please. So, I mean, it looks nice, right? This is a decent house. We are in Marion Oaks. This is South Marion Oaks. It's not far from the Winn-Dixie, which apparently is going to be an Aldi in the not too distant future. Since Aldi just bought them. Is that a Lennox air conditioner? I mean, I'm, I'm thinking, I mean, it's, it's a decent house. It's got water irrigation. I mean, there's like little tiny upgrades that most builds don't have when they're spec homes. I just, I, I think it's a decent house. I would be happy to sell this.